a good opportunity for birdie at the last. Missed it. I'm trying to get a good layup here on this very difficult par five. M misses the fairway, not what she was looking for. Joined here in the 18th tower with Morgan Pressel. With a six iron. That's an awkward lie to pull a six iron out of. Not sure that's going to have enough. Oh, it did just snuck on. That's going to leave her with a quick putt, but I'd say a pretty darn good shot, Kay, from finding that high point. Not even ignore. I mean, she's got her back entirely to the hole. And that's just gaining ever speed as it goes. She's going to end up outside her fellow competitors for par outside of their birdie putts. And that view. It's going to be a plus four opening nine for Chun. Who matched the lowest round of technology presented by Rolex. And Ji Chun. And going with an eight iron, gripping it down, trying to lower that trajectory a little bit. That's the best of the three. Good deal. Yeah, never got that one high enough. See, she's had a little bit of everything so far at this par five. Yeah, you know, I watched her on the range a little bit this morning, Dan. She just looked uncomfortable with her golf swing. She was working hard with her coach, Juan Park, just, just unconfidently hurting more. 120 yards, playing more like 130-35. And a much better is long, been very proficient with it. Did miss one on the last hole on the left rough. That's been her miss today, but striping it right there. She looked unbeatable in the Let's go to 12. And this is Chun's second from 146. Yeah, she looks like she's aiming way right. Good opportunity for her with Lexi in the bunker, but this one bounds out well to the right. Yeah, I think that was a smart play. She didn't think she could stop it going at the flag. Oh, she looked like she hit that a little bit on the bottom of the putter face. Looked like the putter lifted a little bit as she went through impact there. Didn't stay quite as low to the ground as we're used to seeing. So even with a boat. And now Chun ready to go off the tee. This is her seven wood. This club was quite magical for her the first couple of days. Yeah, it's going to leave her just on the bottom side of the ridge with that tricky uphill, then downhill putt. Get up and not control things as much. Up and over that hill. Really good, good speed. That chum became so frustrated. Just grind out these pars. Stays it. Now, NG Chun. And she's giving oh. up a good 30 yards. This is going down the left-hand side. Should be okay. Yeah, it's fine. The, the, the start of that ball flight cave was a bit worrying. There's a penalty area down the left. There's also out of bounds. For NG, that's 160 yards. She's going with a five iron. Yeah, it needs a hop forward. It doesn't get it. So that's going to leave her a part that... Extremely slow up that slope. Then it flattens out a little. Seen a lot of players leave it short from down here. Not this one. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, it is a little short. I tell you what, that was a really good effort, but it was close to going in. That would have been a bonus. It's going to be a four for Inji. Came here at the beginning of last month to check out the golf course and uh, went into the pro shop. This 15th. Almost a half stroke over par has a lot to do with that elevated green after you find the fairway, if you find it. Down below. And it just got dresser technology presented by Rolex. And that's a smooth eight iron. Yeah, landed too far. Just on repeat, everybody flying the. She is really good at those little flop shots. Big par save for Chun. 
But Lexi Thompson's birdie brings her two. Kind of cut across that one high right drive. That was a little bit of the miss that I saw her hitting on the range today. Just now Chung with a second. Yeah, the second shot has been hard for her. She has a tendency to go too far to the right like she did yesterday, but this one should be fine. Yeah, she kind of just fell asleep a little bit yesterday. Kay on that. Closest to her two back. What a shot. Uphill look at as the champion. And that is a huge birdie putt for NG Chun. I love it. I love the. This is right over the top of that bunker. That's going to be fine. It all kind of drips down to the bottom. I go too far, but I think it's going to be absolutely fine. Now needs to avoid the divots. Watch it. Watch it. Yes. Good looking shot. We need to stay on that hill. Yeah, there's a slope there. Is it going to stay? She Left didn't give short. it enough. Yeah. Well, that was an opportunity, a golden opportunity for In Chi Chun. It was for back to back birdies. And she remains five under. Close to the right side as possible, just to keep it in the fairway. Starting down the center, she's leaning on it. So it's had a new tear right, but it's oh. just going to go absolutely perfect inside those bunkers. That, is, that driver has been a strong club for her all week, and once again here on the 18th hole with the one shot lead. Yep. Look at how far that is rolling. Stay out of the divots. Stay out of the divots. This is heading left. She's going to have to get a good bounce forward. Oh, she hits off the down slope. Got an unlucky bounce. Definitely a, sounded like a miss strike. Didn't quite catch that solidly. And that's not going to be an easy. Up and over the ridge. Now down, carrying a little bit of speed. All in all, not too bad. And NG Chung perseveres and wins the championship with a clutch par putt at the 72nd hole.